Souls down in sea. Hey guys, so sorry speaking right now. Um, I want to talk about some of my influences, particularly on uh, making videos and whatnot. You see, I am a huge, huge fan of comics. In case you didn't get that clue pretty clear in a lot of my designs, I fucking love that stuff. I really love it. But as far as uh, the side of YouTube to kind of influence me to actually eventually make videos, I'll start my very first one that I mentioned. If you go back to my older ones that I'm so not embarrassed about now. <laughs> so not embarrassed, yeah. <laughs> uh, which is my old uh, Soul Star Reviews. Uh, I got a lot of influences from, I'm going to be totally honest, from uh, that guy with glasses.com by uh, Doug Walker, who is pretty much my, one of my favorite uh, internet celebrities. But, you know, I, I made a little obvious on those older videos. You can tell right there. But it doesn't really matter. I want—I still want to do it like my way. I keep like in the same way. I keep in the same way I was sounding right now to like uh, the whole vlog thing. Very improv. Very all—all all that. I just no. I'm gonna tell you this right now. I'm not gonna make a damn script. You wanna know why I'm not making a damn script? Because it feels fake. Some folks might still go like, but I like scripts. It's funny and the funny, funny, funny. No, 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 no. Look, it works for some people. Sure, I agree. Scripts do work. But other times, I appreciate it more when it's 100% genuine. Or at least be a little prepared. I usually do come a little prepared for it too. But I'm going to list off a few YouTubers right now that I think deserve to be noticed. Or well, probably already noticed, but they need a little more boost. I feel they need more boost. So I'm going to start with a less player right now. Uh, who is Lotus Prince. I started noticing his work about like a few years ago. I know it's like he's just like a real small YouTuber at the time. He's still kind of small, but he, he's growing though. I remember at the time he was like a real small YouTuber, and uh, <laughs> and I was thinking to myself like, you know, I, I wonder if ever going that guy with glasses dot com eventually. And lo and behold, a few years later, he got on Channel Awesome, which is you know the evolution of that guy with glasses dot com. And I'm so glad he made it, dude. If you're hearing this, more power to you, bro. More power to you on that one. Seriously, I've always respected you. I always, I love your commentary all the time. Seriously, big fan. I'm gonna be gushing over a lot of people today, so expect a lot of dick sucking right now. So much dick sucking. Uh, another good one is uh, an anime reviewer that goes by Aya Soul, who lives in uh, Canada, I believe. I found her out from uh, another channel, which is a uh, Channel Federator, and. I found it so bizarre. I mean, she's like, she stood out to me in such an odd way because it's like her personality come, almost reminds me of my own personality in an odd way. It's, it's weird, I know. But there's certain parts that reminds me of me. And I look at her reviews and seriously, guys, it's top notch work. I'm serious. She has some top notch work. If you've not heard of her, you need to hear of her. She makes some good work. I saw, I saw a subscriber count, I'm like, how the fuck is it that low compared to a person who made this much quality? That's bullshit. So no, you get a shout out too, I don't care. You get a shout out. Another YouTuber who is actually a podcaster, he still is a podcaster, is uh, Corey Coleman. And uh, he used to run this site, a podcasting site, uh, about movie reviews and whatnot, called uh, Spill.com. He had like, other co-hosts as well. Well, he still does on his new YouTube channel, which is now uh, called Double Toasted. Double Toasted is something you guys should really look out for if you haven't seen it already. This motherfucker, man, oh my god. It feels like my, I hear those guys talking. It feels like I'm talking to one of my buddies. When we talk about movies and shit, we're just bullshitting. And oh my god, it, I, I just love these guys. Corey. And, uh. Oh my god, it's all of his, uh, you know, co hosts. Yeah, because I have several co hosts at once. But all of them are just really great people, man. I mean, for real. It feels like you just listen to your buddies just bullshit about movies and whatnot. But they really do, you know, do insightful, pretty good reviews. And, you know, you actually kind of listen to them a little bit. I love these guys. They're great. But, yeah. Um, I'm going to stop gushing for now. And I uh, hope you enjoy this little design I'm doing right now. It looks awesome, don't it? Yeah, it does. looks great. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and say I am indeed still open for commissions, and I'll even leave the link about that, the video about it, on my own descriptions below. Speaking of descriptions below, make sure to like, subscribe, and share. 
because, you know, I I could use it. Also, I have a, uh, you know, a little uh, mm -mm, Patreon.com going on down there, too. Yeah, yeah. That's that's what really pays me. Not not YouTube. YouTube don't pay me very well. No. I got YouTube, and I got, like, my art stuff, and I got my job. So, yeah. I try to keep these things balanced as well as I can. But if you want to talk about the, you know, the channel and whatnot, great! If you hate the channel, great, say something in the comments. Say you hate it. Say you love it. Say you can't give without it. Say you're tired of me dick-sucking all the time. And I'll say I'll stop dick-sucking, sir, when you stop deep throating the truth. But anyway, I'm going to stop talking about that disgusting stuff now. And, uh, this all of fixation is done by a soul star. Y'all have a wonderful, wonderful day. Peace! Soul star is...